As I am putting my glove on, I will welcome you back to the Sea Morning Show. And today we will make a special dish originated from East Java. So join us in our special segment. You masak. Hello, weekends are for cooking at home. Now we have uh, Chef Anya Ugisono right here with us. Hi. Good to see you morning. So, Chef, how are you today? It's good. good. to see you here again. Good to see you too. Yes. Hope you have a lovely morning today. Yes, I do, I do. Uh, especially if you're uh, here with us, it's going to be even more uh, <laughs> lovely. And today is a special day. Uh, mm -hmm. And we're going to cook something very festive. Yes, you know, and just... yeah, very festive and very famous. Yeah, it's very famous. You know why? Why? Because uh, now rawon become like the best soup in the world. The best soup the in the world. The delicious, the most delicious. Food. I thought it was in the top ten list of the best soups in the world. Yes. Apparently, they're number one. Yes. Uh, there is a different media that oh, put a okay. different list on it, and one of it is like one of the best. And for the CNN, it's like number five or number six. Yeah, but one of it is like one of the best things. Ah. Because why? The ingredients is like very many from uh -huh. a different uh -huh. well, flavors. Varies, varies yes, and we're going to make it from scratch. This is challenging. <laughs> In okay. a limited time, right? In a limited time, this is very challenging. But I'll give but... you the trick how okay, to do it. Let's go. So today okay. we will cook that one for you and for you to learn to cook at home. As well. All right, let's okay. go. Drum let's rolls. Start. Step okay, number because one. We don't have much time, so it's gonna be a traditional heritage rawon. Okay. It's from the East Java. For people like you, the young people sometimes don't know what is rawon, right? Mm -hmm. But luckily, you know, right? I, do. I love that. But you don't know about the clue, right? The black nut, that no. the main ingredients of rawon. I only okay? eat it. I don't know what's in it, Chef. That's why you have to <laughs> learn with me every week, yeah. All right. Okay. First, for the traditional rawon, it has to be with the dishes around, uh -huh. and one of it is the tempeh. Okay. You love tempeh? I love tempeh. Okay, so we're gonna make the sambal tempeh. It's like a chili um, base uh, with like... Okay. Uh, okay, the ingredients, we have the chili. I'm gonna fry it a bit. We're playing with a lot, I mean a lot of spices. Yes, and then garlic. Okay. This is like just the main ingredients for the sambal, and also the tempeh. Okay. Okay, so you're gonna help me for cut the tempeh. All right, we'll do. Just cut into like... Two or three, it's okay. Or Small we're gonna mess it everything together. Small pieces? Mm, just, just up to you actually. I like don't mind. We're gonna mess everything together. Are you gonna mess it? Okay. Yeah, just up to you. How do you like it to be? Okay. So we're not gonna cook long for the garlic and the chili. Just for a while to make it like have this good smells and have a good taste. So no need to be very long. Just like a okay. minute and done. What am I okay. gonna do, Chef? Like this, All right. and then we're gonna fry it. Oh, good, goody, goody. I think just more because more? we have a lot of people. Like now, I yes. bring like one kilo of wagyu meat. One okay. kilograms of wagyu meat. meat. Yes, because Here's why? <laughs> Everyone will wait to try. Why I bring the wagyu? Actually, you can use any kind of beef. More. Oh, please. more. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> just okay. finish all. Okay. Okay, but why? Because we have so limited time, so I'm just gonna use the wagyu, so it will be soft. But if you don't have the wagyu, you're gonna use the regular beef. It's okay, but it's gonna take a bit longer time. Okay. Okay. So no, I need you to next? smash it. Can you do I that? I will this? smash it. Yes, only a, just smash it. Doesn't need to be like very soft. Okay. And we're gonna cook backwards. Just can you do it? Yeah. From the sambal first, from the chili, because we need to make the sambal tempeh. Mm -hmm. Okay. So actually, tempeh is very delicious and a lot of protein inside, you know? Mm, yes. So you're gonna have a lot of protein here. You have beef and you have tempeh as mm. well, okay? While we're waiting for this, for the tempeh to be a bit brown, and okay, that's enough. That's enough? It's good. All right. We're gonna put a bit of seasoning, okay? Okay. Do you like a bit of sweet? Because like in Indonesia, we have a lot of country, right? Mm -hmm. And if we cook Japanese food, we have to put sugar. Yeah. Because you know, Japanese like Essential. very famous with the sweet kind of things. Okay, so you have to put a bit uh, salt? salt and just oh, the chicken stock. Okay. Oh, that one, not too salty. Okay, it's gonna be your fault if it's too salty. <laughs> Don't blame me, Chef. <laughs> oh, you're putting pressure on me. Yes, okay. that's why. So if everyone here will try 
the if it's salt, too salty, it's, it's too salty, salty blame on him. Okay. Okay? Probably not. That's a pinch? Yes, that's a pinch. It? Okay, that's it. Okay. After this, we're going to smash the fried tempeh into the sambal. That's it. That's okay. for the sambal. Okay, you know how to make the sambal tempeh now? It's very easy, right? Yes, it's very easy. Only Just chili. Chop uh, garlic, some tempeh. Seasoning. Smash and garlic and chili. Okay. And that's it. So this is step one of making a traditional rawon. But okay. in general, what do we need to make a rawon? Okay, okay, this is only the side dish. Okay. Okay, we have the sambal. And then we also have this sprout. Is a small sprout. Yes. Here. And also we have the salted egg. Salted egg, yes. This is from the duck egg, not okay. from the chicken egg, okay? Mm -hmm. And we also have the sambal that I already cooked. Okay, this is for the side dish. Okay. So you know how to... That's a side dish. Make it. Yeah, and I okay. also have a fresh ingredients here. So you will see why the rawon will taste so mm -hmm. good because we have the fresh ingredients. Okay. okay you hold it for me I first. will. Okay. Oh, this After is this, for the main event. This is uh, what we need to make the traditional rawon. Yes, uh, correct. Batu. So you need the shallots here. Shallots. Okay. okay, I'll put it here. Okay, and then garlic. Garlic, in. Okay, and then chili, as spicy that you want. Mm -hmm. Okay, but I'm gonna just put the big chili because the big chili not spicy, will be right? not that spicy yeah. compared to small chili like mm -hmm. this, okay? And then also you need the galangal, garlic, garlic. and turmeric. Turmeric. Okay, you're gonna like mash this uh -huh. is together. Okay. Okay, and then you're gonna add the candle nut. And please, you have to like fry the candle nut a bit because okay, if first. not, they have like a bitter taste. Okay. Okay. Then you also have just later on. Okay. I have a special trick for you to okay. do. Okay. Okay. Please do let me know. Yes, and then we have the coriander seeds. Coriander seeds. Okay, and we also have this here is the special of raw one. We have cumin. Cumin. Yes, okay. this is the um, how you say the. To make the flavors like more up, more mm -hmm, spices, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and more aromatic, then you have to use this one. Okay, this is to add flavor, not yes. enhance, to yes. enhance the flavor. And then okay. it's like usually salt, pepper, and just a bit sugar. Mm. Okay, and then you have to blend it together with the main ingredients. This is the main ingredients that you have to use when you use raw one. This is the black nut. Black nut. You know, this is called. Mm, cool. a, uh, what you call? Um, is it like if you are falling in love uh -huh. and you feel a bit drunk? Uh -huh. Yeah, this is called like uh, you can feel like a bit drunk when you eat this kind of uh, candle. Oh, really? Yeah. That's Why? Because actually, if it's not fresh, it will make you sick. Okay, like falling so... in love. You know, falling in love sometimes <laughs> makes you sick. Just like when you eat the uh, the black nut uh -huh. that is not fresh. Uh -huh. So you have to make sure that the inside of the black nut it's is fresh. fresh. Okay. Yeah, if not, you will feel like you're falling in love. Sometimes, sometimes you get sick, sick because of the lump. Okay. Right? Okay. So make sure that what, what's the other name for it? It's black nut uh -huh. or kluwak. Kluwak. Yes. Oh, so you have to make sure the kluwak is fresh. Yes. Everything that have like the black color in Indonesia, mm -hmm. they always use kluwak. Okay. okay. Should and, I? No. Let's just let her. Okay. I will. Oh, show, me a trick. Um, show you how to open this one. Okay. Can you see? This is just like a rock, really a hard rock. See? Hard it's rock. Very hard to crack it inside. Yes. Actually, you're not going to cook this black nut. You're okay. only going to use the inside of it. Can ah, you see? This yes. is like a meat. Okay. So if you don't know how to open differentiate, it? Mm -hmm. because sometimes still you don't know how to differentiate which one is good or not. Yes. Then you have to taste it. If what the, do we need if to do? taste is not bitter. Then you can use it. Okay. If it's bitter, just throw it away okay. because it's not good. Okay. So the trick is you have to wrap it with like any kind of like uh, clothes so, yeah, or any cloth, towel. Cloth, yeah. Then you're gonna smash it hard like this. <laughs> knock knock with this one. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna. I'm, I'm gonna only show it to you. Okay. So that's how the trick to open. <laughs> no, scary right there for a no. second. Okay. No, we're not gonna. No, we're not gonna do it here. We're it's gonna be here? a mess. No, I'm okay. just gonna show you how. Okay, but okay? you have one open, right? Yes. Okay. Then you know how to do it. Okay. All right. Okay. Then we're gonna like blend everything together. Mm -hmm. And I already have the blended one here. See, so it's easy for oh, you. Oh, oh, thank you God! I thought we we're gonna do the some dirty me. work right here in the studio. Okay, well, thank God. I just want you to know what is the inside. So clue up with all the spices here. Okay. Then blend it into like those so kind of So when we like, mash it all together, it will shape up like yes. this. Yes. Okay. Uh, so just use the blender, or you can. Also, for being I'm so not gonna ask you to do it this thank you today. <laughs> You're gonna run. Uh, you know, uh, we have the nation right here. So thank you very much. This is a nice gesture from you. Okay. okay so now? moving on. Uh, so this is the sauce to make the soup. Yes. Okay. To make the soup. So this is very important. Yes. The tempeh is done already. I'm gonna just bring it here, and you're gonna mash it everything. 
You know what? Together. If you eat this along with rice, then we'll be it's good. It's nice, as well. right? Yeah. It's a summer you know, tempeh. It. <laughs> it's already good it's already and good. yummy. Okay. okay. So uh, when the tempeh is done, just uh, pull it out. Make sure you have that uh, somewhat brownish yeah. color. Okay. And after this, we're gonna like. Mash the tempeh? Mash the tempeh with the ulakan, the one that you have here. Okay. So it's gonna be your job, okay? That's my job. Okay, after this, I'm gonna like reduce the oil for a while because the oil is like too much for me. And we're gonna like stir fry the black paste a bit. Okay. Okay. I'll be here smashing my tempeh, okay, chef? Okay. Just let me know if you need anything else. Yes, thank you. <laughs> okay, I think that's enough. So I'm gonna stir fry the black paste that we already blend together. Mm -hmm. Okay, into here. So make sure uh, you don't have too much oil in the pan. Yes. You reduce it a bit. Yes, please. I'm gonna cook this for like one kilo of meat, but if you're gonna make smaller, just reduce everything. Okay, then we have also here the lemongrass. Okay. To make it like smell better. And we have the kefir limes as well. Okay. And we also have the this smells so good, chef. Yeah. Even the tempeh smells, smells so good. good. Mix it with the sambal. See? God! just want to eat it with white rice, you know, hot white rice. Mm, I also have the fresh white rice <laughs> for you here. I see it, I see I see the rice cooker you brought with you. Okay, so we're just going to mix everything together and then pour the beef inside. That's one kilogram of wagyu yes, beef. Yes, this is yeah. the wagyu but beef. But you can choose any beef that you want. Yes, why I cook with the wagyu is just to make it faster. I know why you choose wagyu. Why? Because you're leaving for a month. <laughs> You want to make it festive right here today But in the I'm studio. coming back. I know you are. I know you are. Okay. Then we're going to mix everything together. And we have to use this beef broth. Broth, the original okay. beef broth. Because the rawon will not be taste like rawon if you don't have this beef broth. Okay, so how do okay. you make the beef broth? Anyways? It's very easy. I use the fat here. Mm -hmm. This is the beef fat. Because we have to use the brisket part of the beef. That's okay. how we make the rawon. It's like the below of the uh, chest of the beef. They have a lot of fat and it's very good for your rawan, okay? I'm gonna just make it this higher. Okay, I think that's the okay. highest one. Okay, and then you're just gonna boil it for like... If you use the slow cooker, you have to use like eight hours eight to hours. make the broth come out. Okay. But if you use the presto cooker, pressure cooker, maybe like 45 minutes. Okay. So it depends what the equipment that you use. After that, you're just gonna bring everything together. This. All right, I'm done mashing my tempeh, I think. Okay, it's done. It's nice. And right. I'm also done with the rawan. See, it's very oh, easy, right? That's just perfect right there. So, so basically, we just for a while. now have to play the waiting game. Yes, yeah. until it's cooked and mm -hmm. it's boiled, then we're done. All right. And this is Wagyu, so it's going to take like maybe only like five or ten minutes. Because it's going to fast. Yes. All right. Okay, can you see it's like not totally black, it's but not. later when it's got like another 10 minutes, uh -huh. you will reduce the water, it's uh -huh. going to be like turn it into black and uh -huh. black more black. Okay. Yeah, because we are also using the turmeric, turmeric is a yellowish, right? Mm -hmm. So it's going to be a bit yellow, but it's still black, see? After you mix everything together. Perfect, I'm just so hungry right now, Chef, I just can't wait to munch okay. that one later on. Then can you help me to cut oh, yeah. this one? Sure. Okay, this is done with the sambal tempeh. And also, I have this the salted egg here for the dish. It's together. Together. And I'm just going to pour this beef inside. Okay. How much do you want? All. All of Can it? Can you do it faster? No. Okay. <laughs> I've never worked in the kitchen before. Yes, you have me a my lot best. already. I worked in the Sea Today kitchen and nowhere okay. else. Done with everything. I'm gonna just clean up. Okay, this is the sambal. Okay, this is uh, gar fried garlic. And this is the bean sprout. That's it. So easy. I'm gonna put just a bit of pepper a bit. And a Until bit. this part, Chef, you want it cut as well? Yes, please. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna put a bit of cumin again, more cumin. I love cumin. Do you like spices food? Like spicy uh, food? Oh, a lot of spices, yes. Spices and Spi spicy as well. Spicy. Somewhat, but spices, I love them so like? much. So you don't eat spicy that much? I don't eat spicy food that this much. This is not that spicy. Actually. Yeah, 
but I I can stand the spiciness, but I just don't like it on every food. Okay. You know what I'm so I'm gonna just put this spring onion inside. Okay. You want me to help to cut? No. No. Nope. Get for your hand. Okay. I'm gonna I, make a lot of blood. No, 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 no blood <laughs> blood today in the studio. Okay, so see, this is already very nice, very yummy, it smells good. I hope you are in the studio, then you can smell, smell it, it. Yeah, it all smells here. so good right now. Hmm. Smells good, okay? Okay. And then, see, Bring it's onions. not that bad, right? It's fast. We it's just fast. Away. Oh, one more thing, you have to eat it with the shrimp crackers. See, Dan, see, that's the shrimp crackers. It has to be the shrimp crackers. It has to be shrimp crackers. Yes. It has to, make it to be. It's like really and traditional. Nothing else. Rawon, see? Just, so oh, easy. This is perfect. I love Sundays. Just See, eat and you have just. So the producer okay. of the morning show just put me in every Sunday. <laughs> okay, I love, I love, I love. Yeah, because you love cooking. to eat. I love to eat. Not the so cooking. It's part, good. Though. Not the cooking. Not, not the, the cutting part. part. But That's you hard. get used to it. You just have to Hopefully, do a lot of practice. This is and the done. most cooking I've done in years. You know, Jeff. Yeah. No, you're good. When, I, when I'm hosting the uh, you must have. You're a very good. All right. So where are we at right now with the raw one, Chef? We are already done. We just have to wait until it's boiled a bit, maybe like a bit, like two minutes. Two minutes. Ish. Because if you're using this induction, sometimes mm -hmm. it's like longer than the regular ah, stove. Ah, use electricity. Okay, so I just have to try it a bit because every time you cook, you have to try even, even though you already very masterized in everything, mm -hmm. because you have to try and see if it's too salty or not. What you mm. think? No, it's already good. It's already good? Nice. Yeah. Very nice. It's not too salty. Well, I don't know about this one. Oh, no. Oh, no. Please don't, let, do. don't get started on the sambal tempeh. You can try a bit. All right. Let's go. So if it's need more chicken stock, you can add more. I just have to wait for this one. Hmm. I think it needs more flavor. You need more flavor? Yeah, just a bit. You can add more. Which this one? the chicken stock. Okay. Mm. It's, it's good. But it's I good already. So. How, much, how, how much are we talking about? Like that one, yes. Okay, and then you're just gonna mix it together. Just with that spoon, it's also okay. Okay. This is what it All takes right. if you cook with a big portion, it needs time, right? Yeah, it needs a little bit more time. We are, we are talking about one kilogram of wagyu yeah. beef. In the studio. In, in the, and we have to cook it in 15 minutes right? <laughs> or even less. It's like we're in a cooking show, chef. Five <laughs> more minutes. Five more minutes, okay. Okay, I think it's almost done. Okay. You want to try it a bit? The what? The, okay. the soup? The soup. Okay. If it's too salty for you or not. Okay, now I'm going to cook another one. The, what, what not are you cook, cooking? it's already cooked actually. It's already cooked. Okay, yeah, it's a it. salted egg. It's not hot, actually. Oh. Mm. Or you need more salt? A bit salt, I think. Just a bit. Just a bit? Just a bit salt. And then it's perfect. Okay, I'm gonna put it here, and you're gonna mix everything together. Okay, is it enough? Yeah, it's or enough. more? No, 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 we're, we're good, sure? we're good. We're it's already good? good? Yeah. Okay, so this is how you open the salted egg, okay? You're just okay. gonna use the back of the knife, and do like this. And then you're gonna cut into the half. Mm -hmm. And like this, and you're gonna use the spoon to scrap it off. Salted duck egg. Yes, it's gonna be good. Just like this. See? It's gonna be for your special rawan of the day. That's it, then we're just gonna have to wait for a while. All right, are we gonna do plating in a bit? Yes, or are you? Yet. I think actually it's already cooked. Okay, perfect then. Okay, then we're gonna use the fresh rice here. Ah, that's not that one if there's no rice. Yes, and everything has to be fresh to make it good and yummy. Mm -hmm. I think this is enough for you. Yeah, sure. Just for you to try. Yeah, sure. Perfect. Okay, okay. so what's next? So I'm gonna grab this uh -huh. a bit for you, for you to eat. Goody, goody. Okay, the rice is a bit already hot, so... Do you like the fatty part or just the beef? Just any part, Chef. Any part will be good. You eat everything? Any part will be good. Just can't wait to munch on it. Okay. And you will right try here. a bit. Okay, like this. Okay, and right. then you're gonna eat with this salted egg. Yes, please. And okay, then and some the sambal, bean sprouts. Yes, please. And the sambal tempeh, see? Yes, just put it on the top. So you don't really like spicy? Yeah. 
Just a bit? Just a bit. Oh, that's perfect. Just a bit. Okay. And you have to use the crackers and the fried onion as well. Oh, yeah. We can't miss that. Yeah, see? Okay. Go. Dig in. And voila! <laughs> I'm sorry. <clears throat> this is it. Uh, that one, traditional that one. Yes. Our chef, Paniel Bisono. And Rafi. <laughs> okay. So this is... The time where I munch in. Yes, please. Okay. Give it a try. Don't if it's too salty, it's going to be your fault. Keep us away. Keep us away. Yes. Look up. Oh my God. Mm -mm. Damn, how are you, Chef? Wow. Good. How are you? Oh, We're good. good. Oh my good. God. It's going to be a. Smell so a one you good. Been, uh, wow. Inside the raw one. Mm. So I hope it's tender because I only have like five minutes to cook and make it a <laughs> we bit. We believe in you. Well, how by, you? By, by, by the looks uh, of Rami, him, I how come you, wait, Why you just keep quiet? Quiet and not make a sound or just explain how it tastes. I'm enjoying my food. <laughs> mm. You, you say you shouldn't talk with your mouth full, so you're yes. probably going to be quiet okay. for a while. He didn't even, even <laughs> not a word. invited us. I'm here. I'm here. Yes. I'm here. Yes. I think I need one more bowl. Yes, let me get, let me get that for you. Here. Let me just get uh, okay. Mm. So you have wow. this is it with a the fresh black rice. soup. Uh, it's called rawon. Yeah. You know, by the way, Jawa uh, is, is Java, Java because my mom is from Surabaya. Uh, yeah, this is a, actually a really what, a very like a good local, a local soup. dish. Soup. Yeah, and it's already been there like mm, thousand years ago. Yeah, you know? it's very old. From the nine the nine hundred exactly. years, right? So it's really gonna be recipe. our food heritage. Oh exactly, it's very fun. Oh. Okay. It's got a smaller bowl, but yeah. nothing will do at this point. Can't complain. Is it already this salt one the beef? It's amazing. Oh, it, this, is, this is some it, tempe. It's oh. his original cook. It's from you make it from scratch, right? I did. But well, I made this. Good for you. I made this. You made it? You made it? Yeah. 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 How is it? How is the taste? It's good. It's good. Oh, is the beef already it. good? This yeah. 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 Is it already salt? Yeah, yeah. Oh, let me try this first. This is really good. Is Even this with rice alone is already oh, good. Oh man, yeah. of course. So you have it, it, do you like spicy? Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna put oh, the sambal goodness. here a bit this for you. The sambal too, oh my okay. god, and oh the my god. And the oh. Raw. Let's go, right? Go, go, go. Okay. And also so the... Chef Fania is the egg. Salt of egg, man. <laughs> Chef Fania. Amazing. <laughs> Because you have to eat okay. it with the, like the full smells experience. So good. experience how to eat. It's like it's the like local dish. Again, like remember, why today is your masak is very uh, festive, special. It's special because it's all oh, funny as leaving for a month. It's so not coming in the program for the it's, next month. Oh my god, your bowl is very small. I know. <laughs> it's very special. Uh, it's like you have a special rabo rawon at the wedding reception. Yes, but this is with <laughs> yeah. the wagyu beef. Fancy. Fancy, Fancy rawan. Rawan. Fancy yes. rawan, right? Oh, right? Oh my goodness, it smells so good. Let's try it with the sambal tempe, mm. the, the beef. Actually, if you take like, do you like spicy? Yes, I love spicy okay? food, yeah. If you mm. wait maybe like another five or ten hours, it will absorb more. Ah, uh, good things come help. to those who wait. <laughs> how is it? Why well, okay. you don't explain, Rafi, how it tastes? Oh my God. I don't need to explain anything, Chef. It yes, you have. Good. Very because everyone in the team rawan, you want to know we how it tastes. We all familiar with rawan, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Rawan contains a lot of herbs. Yes, mm -hmm. correct. Using the, what, the black one is kluwak? Yeah, yeah kluwak is black nut one. Ah, like oh, okay, that's what gives it that yeah, distinct the, the, the flavor the, and the, the color. The flavors yes. and the colors as but well. But the new generation don't know, but not if everyone knows about rawon, you know, it's so sad. That's why, why that? I have to. I know because I think the kids nowadays it's sushi more, or like ah, pasta, yes. or like all oh, more. Thank you, Chef. Look at that. Yes. Beautiful. Mm. So, um, I uh, we, we've also been mentioning that uh, I don't know if you guys Let brought it up. Let me give you more sure. soups to make Thank it like you. more broth. And then, yes. So this has been named one of the top foods recognized like globally yeah, from Indonesia, so true. right? Exactly. That's why we have to like. Make this oh rawon often at home yeah. for, mm. for all the moms, so oh. the kids will know how the rawon tastes, and they will enjoy the Indonesian oh. food like all oh, we are all the old generation. It's yeah. Indonesian and, food, right? And the salted egg, it's even bring everything the, together, the, right? The, yeah, exactly. The exactly. Flavor. We always say the um, sambal. I don't know the English word, but we'll say perpaduan yang tepat. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. The mixed like combination, the, the combination of combination, flavors. Yeah. They, they complement each other wow. very well. Exactly. That's why I want to have the rawon actually exactly with the salted egg. Yeah. With the, have to be with the shrimp crackers. Yeah. Have to be with yeah. the bean 
sprouts to make everything mm -hmm. very complete mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. elevate mm -hmm. together exactly. one to another. And this yeah. is a very good addition. I've never had that one with uh, Starbucks. Way to, way to pat yourself on the, the back. Yeah. 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 Match. It you know, is very good. Like <laughs> packages, right? Yes. Yes. It is. I have to be very careful because my judge here is from Surabaya. Yeah. <laughs> he, oh, geez. He knows yeah, yeah. Yeah, the original taste of the traditional raw one. Amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. This is well, amazing. anyways, if we keep on with that one, it could go on and on and on. But again, thank you very much, Chefani, for being here. Thanks Always for best luck on your travels. You yes. Oh my yeah. God. Come back soon, Jeff. Come back soon, Jeff. So now we know how to make traditional that one just at home. Maybe mm. you, should, you should give a follow to Chefani on her socials for more uh, menus and dishes and recipes oh my to cook mm. at home. Oh my God. As you guys munch on your uh, rawan. Rawan. Now I'm speechless. Yeah, you didn't say anything. <laughs> I'll, I'll take us a break. I'll take us a break. Guys, we will uh, have a break right now, but we have more interesting stories from Indonesia only on the Sea Morning Show here on Sea Today. Thank you very much, Chefania. Thank you so Best much. Best of luck. Love yeah, that one. Yeah, Peace. Thank you, Chef. <laughs>